guys. Just finishing up the review on this Crossman FX4. It's a model CF47SXS. It's pretty good. It's got the pistol grip. Come with the scope. You got your slide forward safety. Adjustable two stage trigger. It's got the silencer. The barrel ends right here, and the rest of it's all them disc. It's not too bad to cock. You can cock it pretty easy. Got a rubber butt stock. And I've shot it left and right handed, and it didn't change that much. The only thing I can say about this thing is uh, when you're sighting in this scope that come with it, right here in the back of the trigger guard, the boat that holds this in, and these two, they work loose after so many shots. I say if you put some Loctite on there, it'd fix that right up. But overall, put in a decent group free-handed for uh, 83 bucks plus tax, about 80, 89, 25, whatever. This right here ain't bad, it's a real good deal. The scope, after so many shots, it's a center point, four by 32, it bleeds off, which most scopes that comes with these brake barrels ain't worth a hoot anyway. Uh, by the time that you, I mean a half decent scopes, about 80 bucks, and you add it together, this thing right here, I think it's got real good potential for up longer range shooting that had a better scope. And it's super quiet, as you just heard in the video, it's backyard friendly, and it's not a real bad starter air rifle for a 177 I mean you can go to Walmart uh, I was shooting a Premier 7.9 grain uh, hollow points it locked them pretty good it was grouping pretty decent you can take in uh, five bucks 500 shots which you need to run about 400 shots through these things to really elevate that uh, velocity anyway or it's just going to be up and down. You'll get a real high velocity shot and then a lower and eventually it'll plane out. But overall, I think it's worth the money. And uh, anybody just enjoying some backyard planking uh, or if they want to go squirrel hunting. With the right scope, I could see you taking a squirrel 50 to 60 yards easy with this thing. Cause it's definitely got the velocity and it's got a hard hit to it but you can't beat how super quiet this thing is with that with that uh silencer i mean it, it definitely makes a difference because this one right here is one of the newer generations because the older one just had the short piece on the end and it was just naked barrel uh, but overall, the Crossman F4, I'd give it a thumbs up for the money. I mean, if you ain't got a big budget, that's the way to go, guys. I'll do a, uh, another review uh, once I get the better scope for it. Thanks, guys, for watching.